It's a little bit of a rainy day today, but that's okay. S65, it's Carrera S, and Bentayga, nice. Here's a nice Ferrari California. Pretty cool spec, I like the silver on it with the tan interior. Carbon fiber on the steering wheel, you can't really see it. Carbon fiber, it's pretty cool. Good. Okay, so now talking about the C63 and what we will be doing mods wise. He plans on getting uh, what was what exhaust was it? Uh, it's a race exhaust from uh, AWE. AWE race exhaust, and you said you're gonna get a tune? Yeah, I'm gonna get a tune from uh, DME. Okay. Probably push around 650, and then around six to 580 to the wheel. Okay, sounds good. So full race exhaust with. The tune pushing it up to 650 to the crank. Okay, so this other thing we wanted to know is this is the stock spoiler on the car. We were wondering if you should get keep the stock spoiler or if you should get like a wing and just put it on there. We don't know what would look better to be honest. Or maybe start ordering just this and carbon fiber with the diffuser. I think we'll probably get the wing and test it out and if we don't like it, probably take it off. Here, looking down towards the freeway. <laughs> oh, there he goes. And the whole crew to the meet now. There he goes. Oh, man. Do it. You're gonna go after someone. Oh. Okay, there was really nothing at the meet, so I came across the street uh, to Porsche to check out if they have any cars. I mean, they have a couple. We have Ferrari right here, another one over there, GT4, and I think they have a GT3 inside. Here's another Ferrari. I believe this is a 328 GTS. Here, let's make sure. The interior is still pretty clean, to be honest. Let's check it out. Yeah, GTS, knew it. That's sick. They have a lot of Tycons. This is just two right here, another one right there, way more inside, everywhere. They have them over there, and they used to have like 20 or 30 just lined up right there. They got an Alpha 4C, another Tycon, there's that GC3. Oh, that looks so good. There's a red Tycon with a blue one behind it, but that flat six and that GT3 is just amazing the way that car can sound if you put the right exhaust on it or really any exhaust they all sound great on it to be honest see over here by the service lot one tycon they got another one over there in a black there's the gt4 check that out in a little bit there's like three or four tycons just sitting there not to mention the ones that are lined up in this row wow hey this gt4 is really dirty but you guys, I think you guys can tell more so the spec on it. Six speed manual, gold wheels. Hey, that is sick. If you guys are thinking what I'm thinking, I think we should go check out what's inside of there. If you're wondering what's inside of there, they got that white Tycon and another Tycon right behind it. And the top row is filled, so I can't really see, but they, my guess, is probably more Tycons. Meaning, I am. Um, this is Porsche's 50th anniversary car of the Carrera for celebrating 50 years of 911. Um, not too, not too sure on how many were made, but I know that is very rare and very exclusive. 
I think everything's pretty traditional. I think maybe the seats have a little different pattern to them. I, I really like this gray. That is really cool. I like this color on it. That's really pops out and looks good. These brake calipers though, neon green or yellow, whatever you guys think. I think they look really good with the carbon ceramics. Very nicely specced Rolls Royce Dawn with the gray and black and also the black interior. There you go. And the black top, you can't forget about that one. Ooh, GT3 RS. And Dawn. Another one, second one here today. So this right here, you guys may be looking at it, just like it's it's pretty cool. It has yellow and stripe and all this, but it's actually an Edition One uh, GLA 45. So basically, my brother's C63, but the GLA version. And you guys might think, yeah, it's just a cool version of the GLA, but it's actually one of like around 195 for the U.S. and around double for the entire world.